guys! Hey guys, how are you doing? And welcome to a brand new video. Today I have a little bit of juicy Sims 4 gossip for you guys. We have just had a new Twitter drop from The Sims 4, a teaser trailer type thing. It's only 10 seconds long, so don't like get super excited, but we'll take whatever we could get. So we're gonna have a look at that little trailer, um, then we're gonna go through it bit by bit and extract any little details or hints we can find because we wanna know what we're gonna get. Let's have a look. <laughs> okay, that's it. I know that's not long, but hey, there's some exciting stuff in there. Okay, let me just take this a little back and let's just figure out exactly what's going on. So obviously in this first little bit here, we are shown, uh, we're shown like some basic stuff um, that's already in the game. And then it says new stuff pack winter 2018. Now this is an America season. So um, I, I really hope that I am not waiting till winter for this stuff <laughs> in Australia. All right, so here we have the laundry stuff pack, which we've actually heard about. Um, players have actually been able to vote online for what they were wanting in this stuff pack. And we're gonna talk about that later, but let's just look at the goods. Let's check this out. So it's got, um, it's nice. It's got a bit of a more rustic look about it. It's not like a super modern pack. I like that, it's a bit outdoorsy. Are those little pumpkins, that's cute. Loving this, well, you know I love a good plant. Uh, little footstools, really, really cute. Is that like a tire with some flowers in it? A little bit similar to the cats and dogs one. Broom on the wall, some cleaning objects. I like it, we have soap you guys. <laughs> and of course a washing machine, loving this. Uh, and then we've got new hair, which looks absolutely gorgeous. It's like a updo with a clip. I think that looks so nice and this kind of bohemian outfit. I don't know about that dress. And then here we have, I think this is a hair, is that a new hair? It looks similar to a couple of hairs we already have. Um, and then this top is really cool, I like that. Hopefully some new jeans. So yeah, that is looking pretty cool. And then we kind of skip to this other scene that is in a nightclub, these are all base game items, uh, except for this hair. That could be a new tattoo possibly as well, but that looks like new hair to me. Uh, the rest of it I think is pretty, pretty safe to say it's base game. Um, and this guy is talking about a skull and neck a minute, new game pack, winter 2018. Oh my God, <laughs> so excited. But look at this, there is a dancing skeleton. I'm getting real World Adventure Sims 3 vibes right now. So we have like a dancing skeleton. Uh, these Sims are in these new, more adventure looking clothes. You know, they look like explorer clothes, but this outfit with the vest looks a little bit more. It just looks like this guy is obviously dressed to go somewhere else in the world, which I really, really like. I love this greenery coming down. The simplicity of this image is really cool because they are not giving us anything. They're just giving us the tiniest little bit. So we've got some rocky kind of things cropped here. Uh, this stone image of this skull is really, really cool. And this guy's terrified and she's laughing. So it looks like I'm guessing some kind of exploring adventure type of deal is going on here. So do comment down below what you think this is. And was he just like going, ah? So coming soon to The Sims 4. I wanna go back to the game pack. What is this face? Okay, that definitely is looking a little bit like, it looks like World Adventures. I don't think it'll be like Sims 3 World Adventures though. I, I don't think there'll be like puzzles and stuff, but I don't know, we'll see. I guess we'll wait and see. Ah, I'm so excited to hear what you guys think in the comments down below, so do let me know and sound off about that. So I also wanted to tell you guys about um, the laundry stuff pack and why we already knew about it, because I know a lot of you guys watching this video would have had no idea what was going on. But basically, um, players had the choice to vote for the next game pack, I mean stuff pack, and that was going to be either eco living stuff, starter home stuff, arcade stuff, dangerous stuff, or wedding stuff. Now, I personally voted for dangerous stuff because you know I like me some sim deaths. The eco living stuff, aka laundry, got selected, and since then there's been a whole heap of voting. Now, I will link this in the description down below, but this is Sim Guru Graham's corner of the Sims internet. 
verse. And this is where he's been keeping everyone updated with the voting for things like the name and icon vote. Um, so players actually voted what the icon should look like. I think this one's really funny that it got picked because to me it looks like a cupcake. <laughs> but hey, what the people want. So people voted for that. That was really cool. He also shows the top 28 pieces um, that have been selected to work on for this stuff pack. So we can actually look what's going to be in this stuff pack before we get the full on trailers and whatnot. Uh, so that is pretty cool. I think he said he narrowed it down from 68 pieces to 28 pieces from votes. Um, but yeah, so it looks like we're going to get some really cool shelves, this really lovely window here. It's definitely looking very eco, very natural. I love these chairs. I'm so excited to use them for outdoor chairs. And keep in mind, this is just the development stage. So these are subject to change absolutely depending on what the developers choose. But I still think it's so cool that they wanted to get players involved. Like how many games does that? So that is really nice. We've got some laid rugs here. I feel like Graham really likes his laid rugs. I, I, I get this feeling. Uh, floating candles. I love this ironing board on the wall. So cute. Uh, and you sink like a woven rug. I reckon that's a cluster of objects, but I'm not sure I'm going to like that cluster. We'll see though. This doesn't include creator sim, so we're obviously going to get creator sim assets as well. Over here we have the voting outcome of the pieces of clothing that will be included in the upcoming stuff pack. So this is really cool. Here's that dress outfit that I didn't like. I did not like this, um, but I feel like a lot of you guys will. This top's adorable. This top's adorable. This top's cute. I'm obsessed with all these tops. Oh my gosh. I love these jeans too, but I wish they were higher waisted. Some very nice tops here. This one looks like the one that we just saw in the trailer, which is really cool to see them go from concepts to actually being in a trailer. Uh, I think that's really interesting. Rolled up sleeve tops, one's patterned, one's plain. These are everything. <gasps> I can't wait to have these in my game. I need them now. New strappy sandals and also a couple of kids' outfits. This is really adorable. And yeah. So if you guys want to check that out, make sure to click uh, the link in the description down below. I'll be sure to add this forum area there and you can dig through that and I'm sure you'll find a lot more information than what I've given you. Anyway, sound off in the comments down below. Let me know what you think of these packs. What what do you think they're going to be? Are you excited? Uh, let me know. I can't wait to read your comments. And as always, I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon or evening, wherever you are in the world. I'll speak to you soon.